So hey y'all, it's the Costume Jeweler. I'm back at the Red, White, and Blue Thrift Store. So I came back a few days after because I was looking for certain purses that I wanted to pick up and I wanted to see if they still have them. Shockingly, when I came in here, um, they've got some of the ones that I wanted. So I did get them. They've also got some newer ones. So we're going to get this Mark Jacobs. It's a beautiful red pebbled leather purse. Um, but I wanted to come on because I found something really unique that's super expensive that I had no clue what it was or that it would be worth this much. I knew it was micro mosaic. I'm going to show you that in just a second. So we've got that purse. I went ahead, even though I mispronounced it, and I got the uh, C by Chloe purse. I was calling it CB, but it's C by Chloe purse. We got that. We've got so far this beautiful fossil. These are probably going up on eBay, this beautiful fossil tote pebbled leather pretty bag the C by Chloe is a nice bag also I love that red Mark Jacobs we got this brand new let me find got this brand new coach right here and then look at this one right here this is LK Bennett so this bag right here is an LK Bennett bag out of London so it's a simple tote simple brown tote still pretty pretty and I'll show you the uh, let me show you the label on it so this is a beautiful bag right here when I looked at LK Bennett London they run pretty expensive online this is all calf leather so I started not to record this video but after I found this one item that just was tickles me Tickles me pink. I'm going to show you what I did find. Look at this. And I'm going to put it on eBay. So $1.99. This is a micro mosaic cross. I'll show you from afar. And then I'm going to show you up close. So I knew it was micro mosaic. Apparently these are super antique. Let me zoom in on it and show you the detail. Apparently these are super antique. So you see all the micro mosaic of the Vatican there? This was a $1.99. And online, this is no joke. These are running $500 to $995. I just can't believe it. So I like it because it's beautiful. Did not know that it'd be, you know, be online for $995. So $500 to $995. So I wanted to show y'all that. So I guess we'll continue filming in here of the purses and things. Because since we're here, we might as well. And again, since I was here just a few days ago, I'm not going to go through this in depth like we did in that video that y'all saw. Because we've already been here. But we'll just film <clears throat> some more. Look at this Madewell bag. Smells good. All leather. Tote so pretty i swear they hang stuff in here 24 7 so that's made well we're going to pack that one up here's another made well bag right here again beautiful leather bag m-a-d-e-w-e-l-l -L. look at that beautiful strap what a gorgeous bag great brand so again they're still putting stuff out i mean i don't think they stop juicy couture look at this bag it's beautiful too So the juicy bag. And then you have that beautiful, my favorite hang tag right here. Look at this. I love this hang tag. That's a good looking bag right there. A little bit of wear on the handles, but I think that just gives it character, don't y'all? And the interior is great condition, so we're going to get that too. I love it. I don't remember seeing that one a few days ago. This one I do. It's not real leather. If I don't start selling these things on eBay, I'm gonna run out of storage room. So this is that fossil we saw the other day too. Still a cute bag. Just passed on it because it had some scratches on the back. We'll go up to the counter too and just see if they might have put anything new out behind the jewelry. 
never know. Never know. Wow, but what do y'all think about that antique mosaic crucifix and the price on that? I mean, that's just ridiculous. This Kate Spade has a little bit of issues on the handle. What is this, like a bucket bag? Look at this. What is this? I don't know how old that is. It has some staining on the inside for that reason. We'll pass. But look at that. I think I spot it a tool. I don't think that's tooled leather. I thought it was tooled leather over on this other rack. I'm sorry. I'm sitting here jumping around, jumping around, round, 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 round. Look at this vintage Dooney. Vintage Dooney. Pretty. So you can see, there, these, these racks are always full. So this is one. Oh, looky here. Look at little Rosetti. Little bitty tiger, little bitty leopard. What is that zebra print, Rosetti? Isn't that cute? Let's see what it looks like on the inside. Hey, that's a good condition. Look at that. That's good condition. Is that leather? I don't think so. So yeah, I didn't get a chance to do, a chance to do my intro. So I'm the costume jeweler. I thrift daily. I have live videos. I post daily purses, jewelry, knickknacks, whatnot, to do dads and trinkets for resale on YouTube and eBay. So make sure you click that notification bell. Click all so you don't miss out on those. Come to a live buy it now of purses and jewelry. Watch those daily videos. Subscribe to the channel and don't forget a thumbs up for this video. So this is definitely the purse superstore. The video, last video I put out was called uh, Designer Purse Heaven. Is this snake print or eel? I think this is actual snake print, maybe. It's a cute bag. Let's see if it's snake print. Oh, look at this, y'all. So look at this. We're going to get this one, too. Watch. Now, that's a pretty cool vintage bag right there. And I like those. So we're going to get that one. I'll show you up close. So it's black in color. It's not navy blue or dark blue like usual. So we're getting that one. Lauren Conrad. Brand new. It's a Kohl's brand $49 retail value. A vintage Mark Jacobs. I say vintage. It looks old. It's kind of dirty on the inside though, but great condition on the outside. We're gonna pass on it. Saw that one the other day. This and I saw the other day too. It's not leather that I know of. Bessel, B E S S E L. I've just never heard of Bessel. I don't know if it's fantastic or not. Holder, Michael Kors, maybe? Beautiful, isn't it? Let's look on the inside and see what it looks like. The inside is like new. Look at this. No stains at all, not even dust. No stains or dust, huh? I thought this handle was horn at first. It's actually Fashion Express. That's a cute handle and a cute bag. We're not going to get that though. But it's different, isn't it? Here's the one I looked and thought at first it might have been tooled leather. I don't know. It's not tooled, obviously, but is this old? Is it like a vintage purse? I don't know what the brand is. embroidered stitched flowers it's kind of a 70s hoboish here's the back of it so here's the inside of it it's uh it is real leather it says genuine leather made in spain i'll show you that tag 
So you just have the open compartment, so it does need to be cleaned a little. You have a zip pocket right there. And you know what? I love buying things that are made in Spain or Italy and things like that. So let me show you what it says. So genuine leather. I can reach down here. Made in Spain. Really, really cute. Wow, love it. Love it. So what do y'all think about this cool beaded bag? This is vintage for sure. I'm gonna zoom in on it for you so you can see. It's a cool vintage bag. It actually says made in Hong Kong. Zipper top, no tears on the inside. And there's the tag. Look how cute that is. We're gonna get that because you know beaded bags are kind of in. You do see them out. You do see beaded bags out in the store, but why not have a vintage one? So why not? And it is. It's going home with CJ. Uh, it is. It is. Love it, love it, love it. Love purses made in Hong Kong. What is this one? I never look in depth here. What is that? Another beaded bag, but I don't know what that means. Here's the back of it. Another fossil, but not in great condition. Do need the same. Vintage wicker purse. I'm gonna show you up close the hardware. I think we're gonna get this one. I don't think I've ever sold a wicker purse before, but this is old, it's not new, which I think makes it super special. Just look at that hardware there, and look at these handles. That is gorgeous, isn't it? Here's the inside, so one open compartment. And that one was hidden, 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 hidden. I'm telling you, you gotta look closely. You got to look closely, because you're gonna miss something if you don't. And then still you'll miss something. Pretty cool, one step tie-dye kit. Ties up to 30 projects, so you could do up to 30 shirts with this. For real so i think we killed it on the purses again got lots of them now we're looking at the knickknacky what naughty do daddy stuff i didn't see anything uh new that i didn't see the other day look at this beautiful bowl here though i know it sounds like i'm gonna look how pretty that is 2.99 isn't that beautiful I don't sell things like that, but I definitely admire the beauty of it. You have this fish tray here too, serving tray that's $2.99. I just wouldn't buy new if y'all don't have to. I would definitely go to a thrift store, forget me not. I don't know if this is vintage or not. No, it's Teleflora. Pretty. These are super cute coasters. Look at those little piggies. Made in the Philippines. Cute, cute, cute. This is pretty cool if you need a lamp shade. I wonder how much this is, $10. If you've got a lamp and you need a Tiffany style lamp shade, that's awesome right there, look at that. Wow, what a great deal. Really, really cute here, look at this. So you got your little small serving tray. The Lazy Susan. Wow, that's nice. We are looking through the game section now. Look at this whole aisle. And then look at this. Holy cow. Stepping Stone Kit. Now this is cute.
There's so many to look at. But I have a lot. I was just looking to see if there's anything different that looks fun that I don't already have. There's so many though. Uno attack. Needle point. That'd be kind of, oh, it's a puzzle. And they have tons of plush animals. If you're into that sort of reselling. Lots. It's not a real bonsai tree, but isn't that cute? We're going to check out the jewelry again. See if there's anything we missed out on. A little bit of everything in this store. Not going to look super in depth. Some more amethyst. Oh, that's a pretty necklace. So it's going to be a long. You could double it up. It has some ship wheels on it. Looking for the tag. I love amethyst. Not really seeing anything we didn't see the other day. This is new. This right here is probably new. Also, let's take a quick look at these wallets again. See if there's anything here that we missed. Some looks uh, don't feel like leather. Super cute fossil cross body. It's not, it doesn't look like the right chain for it, but I guess that works. But it is cute. This coach again, I've seen this before. I've actually sold one of these before. We saw that the other day too. I'm not seeing if we've got anything that's actually new. Super cute Cloisonne out earrings. Look at these. Love those. Not marked. We're going to get those. Those are probably about an inch and a half long. Probably about an inch wide. Cute. Look at these. These look handmade for sure. Look how gorgeous those are. Look at the back of them. These are gorgeous. And they're going home too. Y'all see those in a future sale. Look how unusual these earrings are right here. Look at that. Aren't those pretty? So they're all there. They're all, no rhyme or reason, to the lineup. But they're all there, none's missing. And there are hoops on top of that. I think we'll get those. Vintage Avon. Mm, these are cute. And look at these crystal ones right here. Aren't those cute too? And do correct me in the comments if I'm wrong, and I could be. But this looks like a Betsy Johnson Fleur de Lis keychain pendant. And I'm gonna tell you why. Look on the back at the hearts. So we're going to get that one. But it's not any rhinestones missing. Gold tone, pretty keychain pendant. That's awesome. Crazy cool homemade. There's the back of them. Oh, wow, look at these. These are heavy, but they're too unusual not to get. They're pierced, and they're beautiful. So we're going to get those red rose earrings. No, you didn't. No, they did not try to hide these cloisonne star and moon earrings for me that have flowers and butterflies on those. Look how gorgeous those are. Probably about an inch or two inches long. Those are going home with CJ. Beautiful. Are these wedding cake bead earrings? They're glass. But not sure, but we're going to get those. I like those. And ladies and gentlemen, I don't know if these are sterling or not, but we're going to test them. One is kind of gold tone. Both of them used to be gold tone. Still pretty. These may be amethyst. I don't know. They may be am amethyst circles. We're going to check them out when I get home and test them with the Presidium tester. But we are going to buy those. Those are great. And they're pierced. These are pretty, but they are missing rhinestone at the top. Aren't those gorgeous? Here's some beautiful Anne Klein earrings. They're marked AK on the back. Those are kind of gorgeous, aren't they? 
I think we'll go ahead and get those. I love right there the articulation of them. These are gorgeous also. And look at these beautiful dichroic earrings right here. Look at the front. Wait for this. Y'all ready for this? Look at those. Aren't those gorgeous? We're going to get those too. Those are awesome. Y'all know I love rhinestones and this is no exception. Look how beautiful these silver tone earrings are. Those are probably about two inches long, one inch wide. Aren't those gorgeous? Let's see the back. So the back is also silver tone. Now that's a quality pair of earrings there. So these earrings right here kind of look like they would be gold. They're not marked gold, but I will test these. Can't see any markings, but those are real pearls. And these are clip-ons. They're lightweight, so we're going to get those. I think they're beautiful. We're going to zoom in on these because I'm thinking these are sterling silver. It says Mexico on them. I'll test them. But I'm trying to see up close. I can't tell here with my phone right now if that's 925 or what it says up in Mexico. Look at the front of these. We're going to get them. We are getting those in hopes that they're sterling, but even if they're not, they're beautiful. So y'all will see those turquoise small stones and enamel earrings out on a future sale. And we've got our alpaca earrings. You know, I love those. Look how pretty those are. Now look at these unusual earrings. There's gold chips inside there. Look at that. So some probably 24 karat gold chip inside those earrings. We're going to get those. These are long, aren't they? Look how long those are. Probably three inches. I'm glad I pay semi-attention to detail because look what we just nearly missed. Look at that beautiful Egyptian Pharaoh keychain. And look at the back. What is this? Is this bone? Resin? I'm not sure what that is. Is that Y'all answer in the comments below. Is that bone? It's kind of heavy. Here's the side of it. But look at that beautiful thing there. Wow. I think somebody's going to appreciate and love this pewter keychain also. Look at the front of it. Isn't that cute? Another cute keychain. Paris, France, Eiffel Tower. It says Paris on the keychain. Love it. Wood carved buffalo keychain. So I try to leave the store, but I keep scoring. So look at these earrings here. Keep scoring, so I've got to stay till we're done. This is ridiculously fun. And look at these right here. And look at the good surprise on the back of them. Mexico, Mexico, and they're thick. Taxco, Mexico, Sterling. And these cute little rings here are made out of shell. Look at that. And then you've got this right here. Look at these. These are cute. So they're Disney, but they'll probably sell. And they're Mark Disney on the back. So we're going to get those. Ooh, that gray coach is pretty. Look at that. Look at this sterling micro mosaic. Cross necklace. Sterling here. And you got all of these sterling rings too.
Okay, y'all, that's it. We bought a lot more stuff again. So I came here a few days ago, came back again, couldn't help it, found more new stuff. So again, my favorite thrift store. Got all this, got all that. And until next video, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Hit that notification bell, click all. Thumbs up for the video. We'll see y'all in a cell soon. Bye. I said bye, but look at this. I'm still looking. Bye-bye-bye.